Over 60 years ago, Skeeter invented the first bass boat, and now they offer multiple boats for different anglers' needs. The ZX-190 is a tournament-ready boat with a very special engine on the transom, but more on that later. This boat shows the optional dual console, but the main focus on the ZX line is form and function. It's a boat that performs just as well on the way to the fishing spot as it does when you're there. A professional level trolling motor is up on the bow and features a foot pedal control. There's also an extra fish finder and bow trim switch. It may not look like much, but you can fit more than a day's fishing gear including tackle, multiple rods and life vests in the bow storage lockers. The wife will love the optional second console on the ZX-190, but the helm is the true standout on this boat. Bass boats are mini performance boats, and the 190 has a hot foot throttle, steering wheel trim, and a full gauge ray to keep an eye on the systems while you're blasting down the lake. The live well switches may seem awkwardly placed, but I think it's a great use of space by Skeeter. Now Skeeter is a Yamaha boat company and this ZX-190 is powered by Yamaha's brand new 150 horsepower VMAX super high output. This mini power plant builds off their widely successful VMAX SHO line. It brings power, performance and weight savings to that mid-range package. When you take away the oil tank that the old VMAX 2-stroke needed, the new SHO that replaces it is actually lighter. The other big story with this motor is its incredible hole shot and mid-range power. They borrowed from 2-strokes and used variable camshaft timing to get the optimal performance out of this 4-stroke. And perform it did! Top speed was 59.1 miles per hour at 6,000 RPM and it would cruise all day long at 34 miles per hour at 3500 RPM. Yamaha changed the game when they first launched the VMAX SHO in 2010. Well, with the new 150 packaged with the ZX190, it changes it all over again.